Hey guys, this is my Oscar nomination series, and this is where I pick my favorite games for the specific month. This month is June. Most of the PC games I play are low budget indie games. And because of this, the games that are included in this series are the games that I personally play on PS4. With that being said, most of the games are available on other platforms and not necessarily exclusive to the PS4. This month I played 10 PS4 games. Kind of insane, 10, I think that's actually the most. Um, so to narrow the list down, I'll give four Oscar nominations, one being the Oscar winner. Some of these games have really impressed me this month, and I'd love to know in the comments down below which games you enjoyed seeing on the channel. Let's jump in, shall we? Number four, Masquerade, The Baubles of Doom. This is an action-adventure game set in a fantasy world of the realm. You are searching for the most powerful orbs in all of the land. The humor is downright strange. I mean, you collect clown noses. Need I say more? This game is available on PC, PS4, PS3, Xbox 360, and Xbox One. Currently $15 on Steam. Number three, Oceanhorn, Monster of the Uncharted Seas. This action-adventure game focuses on a young boy's quest to find his father and defeat the sea monster, Oceanhorn. These 3D graphics are awesome and bright and colorful. The puzzles were fairly easy, but with a game rating of a 9 out of 10, why not just try it? Available on Android, iOS, PS4, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, Windows, and PlayStation Vita. Number 2, Strider. Strider is a platform adventure hack and slash game originally released in 2014. The controls are great and the demo only left me wanting more. The boss fights were creative and I can't help but be grateful for Capcom. Available on Windows, PS3, PS4, Xbox 360, and Xbox One. Currently $15 on Steam. And the Oscar goes to... Can you guess it? <laughs> Well, number one, Metro 2033. This is a first person shooter survival horror game based on a Russian novel. Set in the ruins of Moscow after a nuclear war, you must survive by living in metro tunnels. This game gives you a sense of urgency with the lack of ammo lying around and the deep dark tunnels. Oh, and an evil mutant race known as the Dark Ones. Great graphics with an eerie gameplay. Available on Windows, PS4, Xbox One. Let me know which games you enjoyed this month. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.